Can 3,000-year-old passages of the Bible contain a modern-day treasure map for the discovery of oil in Israel? Zion Oil & Gas is betting on it. With over $70 million invested to date, the American corporation based in Dallas, Texas, traces its origins back to the convictions of its founder, John Brown, an evangelical Christian. In 1985, the American businessman began his pursuit of oil in Israel based on passages of scripture. The geologists who use purely scientific techniques to identify the spot that John came to from the Bible confirmed that this was a good spot geologically to uh, drill. So there seemed to be, shall we say, a confluence or a coming together of biblical teaching and modern science. Today, the company holds three petroleum exploration licenses covering almost a quarter of a million acres from the Jordan Valley to the Mediterranean Sea. The study that was released by the United States Geologic Survey indicating the significant potential where all of Zion's rights are represented. All around Israel are oil and gas producing countries. So when you couple the two factors together, you're led very obviously to the conclusion that yes, there is going to be more oil and gas production here in Israel. However, after six years of drilling, only modest amounts of the hydrocarbon have been discovered, quantities too small to make production economically viable. Recovering oil in Israel is fraught with challenges. Our belief is that the reason onshore Israel there haven't been the discoveries that we believe are going to come is because you have to drill deep. And frankly, if you go back 10, 15, 20 years, there wasn't the technology to get as deep as, deep as we're going. We have a thousand tons of equipment on this site to get to over 19,000 feet. That's a depth of over three and a half miles underground, qualifying Zion's Ma'anet Joseph No. 3 site as the deepest oil dig in Israel to date. However, if Israel's onshore oil reserves mirrors in scope its vast offshore natural gas potential, the tiny Zionist state could be loaded with hydrocarbons. But even more arresting than the potential fortune underground is what prophetic scriptures foretell will take place on the ground within a 15-mile radius of Zion's current oil rig. I'm standing on the hill of Megiddo. Behind me is the Valley of Jezreel. Now, according to the Bible, this is the place where the armies of the nations will gather to fight in the great end-time battle of Armageddon. In recent months, Zion oil and gas stocks have plummeted in value. Yet investors are hopeful that in time, onshore blessings of the deep will be within reach. Marnie Blom, Axe News Network, The Levant Basin, Israel.